As you've heard recently, the Delta emulator has made its way onto the iPhone as well as onto the iPad. So let's talk about how you can set it up on the iPad. So all you need to do is first off, download the app from the App Store. There's really nothing to it. But once you download it, just go ahead and press on open. And when you press on the settings button on the top left corner, it takes you here. And you can see this is what, these are all the emulators that you can choose from. So there's the Nintendo, Super Nintendo, then Nintendo 64, Game Boy Color, Game Boy Advance, and then Nintendo DS. And this is also where you can customize your settings. But basically, in order to import your games onto here, just press on the plus button at the top right corner and press on files. Then select whichever files you want to open onto the emulator and then press on the open button. And basically, in order to open the game, just tap on it. There's really nothing to it. And then in order to save your progress, just press on the menu button and press on save state and press on the plus button. And you can also see here that it, that it automatically saves your game once in a while. And in order to load your progress, just press on the just press on the load state button and select one of the states that you saved. And that's really all there is for saving your game files. Now, in order to open the Nintendo DS games, you will be missing some files. It says missing required DS files. And when you press on import files, you'll be required to fill these in. I'm going to leave a link in the description on how you can fix this problem. Just go through the video and once you do that, you'll be able to use the Nintendo DS emulator on your iPad. Now that's really all there is for the tutorial. I hope you all found this helpful and if you did, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out my channel to see more videos like this in the future.